I don't like this exit Normandy shit though. Don't like it. Liara, let's get you out to go see the sights. And hmm, I'm gonna take you, Tarly. I won't be doing much uh, fighting, so no. take the ladies out. Show them a good time. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. How about you start opening the fucking door? Logged. The commanding officer Thank you. is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Who's this creepy faggot? Hello? Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. I'll salute you. Commander Shepard, SSV Normandy. You don't know who I am, do you, Commander? I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. Then the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I still serve the Alliance, sir. As a Spectre, I can advance our interests to the Council. Huh. You still know what color your blood is, Shepard? I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the Council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. This ship saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills for the same price we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Hell no. Normandy is an Alliance warship, but she's on loan to the Citadel. That means she's not in your chain of command. I believe there's something wrong with my ears. Did you just contradict me? Damn right I did. This ship is council property right now. So, respectfully, please clear the gangway. Have it your way, Commander. But expect me to file a report on this. Damn right. Fuck off, you wanker. Yeah. You don't... See that, ladies? You guys would lack a badass. I just told him to get stuffed. And he did. And he's an admiral. Rear out. He's only a rear admiral, so he's at the back. He ain't that good. But we told him to get stuffed. After years of poor economic performance, Exogeny has announced that its research colony on Pharos is finally returning a profit. You're welcome. New discoveries and a dedicated colonization effort have finally paid off for Exogeny. You're welcome again. Exogeny's stock rose sharply with the announcement, with investors pleased at this surprising news. You're fucking welcome. That was all me. See, we did that. Liara, we did that. Not you, Tali. You weren't there. But Liara, me and you. We did that. We helped out them. Um, where the fuck are we going? Oh, yeah. Yeah, my head is just... It's all over the place. Okay, so... Commander Shepard? No. Not you. Kalisa been seen in Aljolani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? What sort of questions? People back home have heard a lot of wild stories about you, Commander. I can give you the chance to set the record straight. What do you say? I say get stuffed. I don't have time to justify myself to your viewers. I have a galaxy to save. Excuse me. Your choice, Shepard. How can she vindify me? I don't know. Vindicate? Vind I don't know what the word is. But, you know, I told her I was just saving the galaxy. If people are gonna disrespect me. They can get fucked. I wouldn't tell them that because you, know, you don't, you don't, you don't say that to the rabble. But um, Citadel Tower, that's what I was hitting. You got to show some respect to society, not to that rear admiral faggot, but society as a whole. Okay, where is this guy? Was he over here? Yes, there he is. I swear this guy was the exact same guy as. No, I'm waiting to see no, one of good. the counselor's assistants. Commander, any word on my missing men? I'm not sure how to tell you this, Admiral. Your men were killed by a thresher maw. A thresher maw? That's not. My men wouldn't just stumble into a thresher nest. Not the entire unit. Somebody lured them there with an Alliance distress beacon. Placed it perfectly so they'd land right beside the thresher nest. Damn it. 
I had a bad feeling about this ever since my team disappeared. An Alliance beacon used as bait, my unit wiped out, and nobody seems to know anything about it. Commander, I appreciate what you did. Now I need to do my part. The families of those Marines deserve to know why they died. Anything you need from me? Not right now, Shepard, but I'll let you know as soon as I find something out. I hate to be the deliver of bad news. Uh, journal. Is that upgrade? Update. Uh, we still got so many missions to go. Whew! There's gonna be a lot of sweet missions. Who's this? Oh, Wongy! Hello, Wong. Hello again, Commander. I've got a proposition for you. Since you helped me get information on the crime syndicate, I've gotten a lot more backing from my publishers. I'm investigating traffic controller conditions now, and I wondered if you could help. That seems like a step down from wide-scale corruption. Actually, in a way, it's more important. This isn't about people getting rich. This is about safety. I've heard rumors that the space traffic controllers are overworked to a dangerous degree. I can't get into the control room, but you could. If you planted a bug inside, I could crack the story. If you crack this story, what's likely to happen? Ideally, there will be calls to improve working conditions by hiring more controllers and upgrading systems. The Council won't pay for improvements voluntarily. This story will provide that pressure. This bug you want me to plant, could it interfere with traffic signals? Absolutely not. I made certain that the frequencies it uses won't interfere with anything. Good, at least she's sinking ahead. Good. I can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. Give me the bug. Excellent. Just place it on a terminal with a good view of the area. Thanks again for your help. In the long run, this story is going to save lives. Better, I'll bitch slap the woman out of you. I'm gonna check my map because I don't know where I'm going. Um, can I zoom out? Uh, I wanna go see the. Damn it! I've got to go to Presidium. Got to go to the Presidium. Um, there's nothing else in here. I've got. What did I say I was gonna do? Oh yeah, that's right. I do have to go to the Presidium. Oh, the embassies. I mean, embassies. And I'm pretty sure that someone told me. That if you go down to that little hallway where there was absolutely nothing, there's someone down there you can talk to. So I'm going to go have to go check that out. This episode shouldn't be too long. Hopefully I can end it in a ten minutes or so. Hopefully. Maybe I can help Samesh Batia out. <laughs> I kind of left him hanging last time. And I feel bad about it. So let's go fuck shit up with this other guy. Let's go teach him a lesson to not... Why I still haven't played the Spectre card of this guy, I do not know. How can you refuse Spectre authority? It is like, no one can do that. Oi! Hello again, Commander. Can I help you? Uh, this isn't right, man. I understand what you're trying to do, but holding the body is wrong. Commander, you of all people should understand how far we must go to protect humanity. I do, and it's just unethical. Not if we lose our humanity in the process. I'm out there fighting to stop crap like this. All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Batia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Damn right. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Better, you dumb prick. Or oh, I would... You're lucky I solved that or I would have backhanded you. Yeah, uh, Nasana, there she is. Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I see you got my message. You said you had a job offer. I do. My sister Dahlia is a crewman on the cargo vessel operating out beyond the fringes of the Traverse. Her ship was attacked by privateers. There were no reported survivors. I'm sorry for your loss. This is where it gets complicated. Last week, I received a message with her voice on it. Dahlia is alive! The rest of the crew was killed. But she was taken prisoner. The slavers demanded a huge ransom from me in exchange for returning her unharmed. Coming up with the ransom seems like the best way to ensure Dahlia's safety. That's what I thought. I did what they wanted. Transferred the funds to the account they specified. Only they never released her. They haven't contacted me since. I've made a terrible mistake, Shepard. I'm a diplomatic emissary. 
By law, I'm required to report any attempted extortion to CSEC immediately. But I was afraid for Dahlia, so I just paid the ransom. Now she's still missing. And if anyone finds out what I did, I could end up in jail. You got in over your head and you expect me to pull you out? This is easy money for you, Shepard. I've already found her. You just need to bring her back. I tracked the ransom payment through several accounts. Eventually, it led to a small mercenary band operating out of the Artemis Tau Cluster. I need you to go to the Merc base, take them out, and bring my sister back. You shall be well rewarded. I'll do it. Don't worry. I'll bring your sister. But I don't back. trust you. I don't trust Thank anyone you so in Mass Effect. Right apart from my crew. Come back and see me when the job is done. Okay, I still I'm gonna go my eye on Unisana. I don't trust you. Hmm, Fredericks. What do you want? Hey, oh, Commander. watch the tone. Is there something I can do for you? Not really. Just saying hi. Enjoy yourself, Private. Commander. This place seems strange. I wish there were more humans around. Yeah, there we are. Uh, I'm gonna go talk to some mesh, but first I want to find where this mission. There's some mesh. I don't know where this trafficking thing. What's that? Oh, Vena. So it's not on this level. Okay. Uh, I gotta go check the journal actually. For that mission. Plant the bar. Emily Wong has approached you again and asked you to help with her next investigation by planting a bar at the old traffic control station. Go to Citadel Security and plant a bug in Citadel Traffic Control Center near the back of CSEC. I'd say it's that empty room that we went to last time, that I had no idea what it was. And I don't talk to Palin, fuck that wanker. Sorry about my language. My French, I'm practicing it a lot more lately. It's getting a lot more fluent, slack. Fuck, cunt, twat, which isn't French, but... Welcome to the Shut up. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? I reminded Mr. Bosker what we're fighting for. Your wife is coming home. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. I feel you, bro. I feel you, man. I feel you. I feel you. Um, I don't know where I'm heading to next. See, sack. See, sack. See sack again. See sack. <laughs> oh, imagine if that's what it's called. See sack below belt. <laughs> oh, I've got to start trying to make these puns. Terrible at them. Okay, so this is See sack Academy, isn't it? So I'd say it's at the end of this thing over here. Yeah, right there. Plant the bug over there. Okay. Yeah, thought so. I had my suspicions. And to be honest, I never did this anything with Emily Long. What? Emily Long. Emily Wong last time. I don't. I might, what is wrong with my English? As I uh, said before, you uh, do not learn the English language very well. Yeah, there's a wanker over there. Okay, stop it. For this room just looked like it was for nothing, but apparently, this is what it's for. Um. Good. I planted the bug. Now it's sneak out of here. Before they see us. Run! Run! No, he can't sprint. Slightly jog away then. Okay, what is it we have to do now for her? Form Emily. Return on the Sira and inform Emily Wong that you're planting the listing of us. Okay, okie do 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 Firstly, I want to go down into that area, but I don't remember how to get there. It's not through there. Pretty sure it's not that way. I don't know. I'm not very good. I, I don't go down there very often. So we're going back to Citadel Tower. Yeah, I've got about six minutes or on on this, so mm. I don't know. Don't know how long I'm going to split these episodes into. But we'll see. We'll see. It's been a long recording session, and I kind of want to get it done. Um, even though it's such a good story, I I'd like to take a break every now and then. Hello, Emily. I'm already getting readings. This is going to make a great story. Absolutely. Thank you so much for your help. 
Here, this is everything I've got from my publisher's budget. It was no problem. Good luck with your story. It deserves to be heard. I appreciate your support. I hope this will save some lives in the long run. Thanks again for your help. I'm gonna show this to my publisher. Is that all? Not even a hug. She just friends on me. Um, what else have we got to do around here? I know I've got only one more Citadel mission that I think... I don't know. The fan. I want to figure out what I do with Conrad Werner. It's still there, so... I might go look around at some levels. Um, I wanted to go to the med clinic area. So, that's the wards, I'm pretty sure. There's nothing in... Poor med clinic. Yeah, med clinic. There's nothing in the Presidium apart from Sinesh Bhatia. And I kind of want to find Conrad Werner. If he's even around. I, I don't know what this mission does. I don't know. It just says there can't be any problems with him. So, that's got to mean nothing, right? Sorry, I've got to go in here for a second. I've got to check out this accent. Yeah, hey, Michelle, how are you? I need those supplies for my clinic. I can't. You can and you will, or your story won't stay secret for long. Don't disappoint me, Doctor. I'll protect you. Oh, Commander Shepard, I didn't see you come in. Every time I come in here, I see someone threatening you. Who is that? Someone from my past. I can take care of it. I might be able to help you. I was fired by my previous employer for giving out free medical supplies to clinics like this. They never filed any charges. They just wanted me to leave without any fuss. But somebody must have found out. Now they are blackmailing me. I have to give them what they want. If the board finds out about my past, I could lose my license. They'll shut my clinic down. Maybe I can get you out of this. Tell me what they want. I have to give some of my medical supplies to a merchant in the markets. They expect delivery today. Give me your contact's name. I'll deal with this guy, whoever he is. Deal with him? But won't they expose my past? They won't bother you again. I guarantee it. I see. Maybe it's better if I don't know anymore. Yes. I was told to speak with a merchant named Morlan down in the markets. Morlan. I really appreciate this, Commander. Thank you. Morlan. I don't know where I've heard that from before. Okay, yes, I'll help don't you worry. out. Don't worry. I'll take care of it. I only came in here to hear that luck, sexy Commander. ass Be accent, careful, down but, you know, if I can help you out, no problem. What is it without both the doctors that we know? I've got two of the best accents I've ever heard. Um, who's this over here? That's a store. Med clinic. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to think here. That goes to Flux Market. Presidium. Uh, I'm just gonna look around everywhere. I don't know if I'm gonna miss anything. Uh, I know down here's that guy. A lad over there. Big fan. I don't think Flux would be anything we're looking for. <laughs> Sorry if this gets boring me walking around like this. Uh, I'm trying to not miss anything, I'm trying to get all the story, all the loopholes fixed and put together. Everyone here seems so busy, so rushed. I wonder if they have This isn't a proof of purchase. It's a bank statement. It shows that I bought something from you when I bought it. Well, thank you for buying from me, but this still doesn't prove that you purchased that item from my store. But I didn't buy anything else here. How do I know that? If you don't have the proof of purchase, I can't help you. But Sorry. What a hustler. Um Merchant Ah, Verna. There are rumors on the extranet that you've been made the first human specter. That's incredible. <laughs> I'd love to say get lost. 
Being a Spectre is a big responsibility. I just want to make humanity proud. The vids are all talking about Commander Shepard fighting for all of us back home. And they also say that you don't take crap from anybody. You're showing them what humans can do. Hey, can I get your picture? Ah, uh, I suppose... I don't have a problem with it, but why? You're a hero, Shepard. Decades from now, humanity's going to remember you. And I'll have your picture. That's creepy. Just hold up your gun. Perfect. <laughs> That's fucking creepy. <laughs> Thanks again, Commander. Oh. I'm gonna hang this in my living room. My wife will love it. Oh, I'll love your wife, if you want. Dude, Verna, you are a creepy motherfucker. I'm sorry, but that you are... That's just weird, man. Okay, this is a lower mark. It's Marlon, where are you? Moreland, that's it. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? You were expecting a delivery of medical supplies? But I was told the doctor would be bringing them. Things have changed, Moreland. A change, but the doctor... I don't... This is not right, human. Shut up, Moreland. I told Baines you'd screw this up. What the hell's going on here? Who are you? Leave the doctor alone. We can end this if you just bring me those supplies. Otherwise, I'll start telling people about the doctor's little secret. You're shutting down a medical clinic. What if someone needs treatment? What if you need treatment? Hey, hold on! I'm just the middleman here. This is way more than I bargained for. <laughs> Thank you, human. It is good to see him humbled so. What do you know about Baines? I have never met him, human. I only worked with the one who spoke with the doctor. Mm hmm. I don't really need to buy Goodbye. anything. He's a medical supply salesman. Yes, all right then. Good tidings to you, human. Oh, absolutely to you too, lad. Yes. They speak so weirdly and fast. So we now talk back with Dr. Michelle, I'd say, about who this Bane... Bane is. <laughs> I love you every fun for another guy, and he goes like, fuck, what? Hell no! Uh, okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's Dr. Machine. She's got to say so. I, I'm watching Channel because I don't trust about to go back there. You do. I get to hear some of that sweet ass accent. Is she got like a Russian accent or something? I don't know. But all I know, it is fine. Absolutely fine. Hello, Dr. Michelle. Let's hear that voice again. Commander, how did things go? He won't be bothering you anymore. Really? That's a great relief, Commander. Thank you. I can't pay you for your help, but I can give you a discount on any supplies you purchase here. The thug said he worked for a man named Baines. Sound familiar? Baines? I wonder if he means Armiston Baines. We worked together a long time ago. Who is he? What can you tell me about him? Last I heard, the Alliance military was contracting him for some research in the Traverse. Perhaps Captain Anderson will have some knowledge about this man. Very intelligent. Let's see what the captain can tell us. I wish I could tell you more. Is there anything else I can help you with, Commander? Uh, I'll see Let me supplies. take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. Hmm. Oh, pretty much upgrades. So, yeah, no, I'm not, not interested in that. I was hoping she'd have some medieval upgrades, but no, apparently not. Anderson, where is he? Would he be at... The embassies? I don't know. I think you should be at the embassies in uh, Counselor, not Counselor, Ambassador Udina's office. Hopefully. I don't want to be running around while like, getting lost, but you know. Conrad Verna, I'm still strung up on that picture though. That was so weird and awkward. Welcome to the Presidium. 
Allow me to be your guide. Allow me to be the big fuck off in your face. Okay, so he, yeah, he's up here. I can see that. Is he up here? Uh, uh, I hope he's up here. What? I should check the journal every time before I do something. I feel stupid when I don't check the journal. Um. Where is he? Yeah, what's it called? Rogue VI, get that to me. I don't know. Oh, there they are. Um, Anderson. I saw your fellow's report. If we had known anything about the Thorian, Exogeny would never have been given the permits to start a colony there. Thank God the colony survived. We can't afford to have too many failures out in the Traverse. It's one of our major expansion regions. You don't give a damn about the colonists. It's all just politics to you, isn't it? We can't all be the hero who charges in to save the day, Commander. But we each serve humanity in our own way. You can't escape interstellar politics. It's part of the big picture, and sometimes it isn't pretty. I slap you. Just ignore him, Shepard. The ambassador's a little bitter sometimes. Comes with the job. I want to talk to you, Anderson. Yes, Commander. Baines. What do you know about Armiston Baines? Where did you hear that name? Never mind, I don't want to know. Baines is dead. Has been for quite some time. The people I spoke with seem to think he was still alive. It's not common knowledge. Military is keeping it under wraps. Baines was doing some high-level work for the Alliance. Stuff even I wasn't aware of. One day he turns up dead on a drifting scout ship. Everyone suspects it was foul play, but it was never officially investigated. What can you tell me about the ship? I don't know much about it. You should talk to Admiral Kohoku. One of his crews discovered Bane's body. I spoke to Kohoku. He never brought it up. You should mention Bane's the next time you see him. See if he'll tell you anything. Is there anything else, Commander? That should be it. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. Good, okay, so we need to go talk to Captain Co... Captain? Admiral Co... I don't know what he meant. Yeah, Head back there, because it's a bit... Big shitload of running around. And I'm 100% sure there's one more mission with Emily Wong. But I don't know when or where. Maybe I've got to do just one more main mission and come back here. I'll probably come back here in between every mission anyway. Every main mission. So after I go to Nevera, I'll come back here and check on everything. After Nevera, I'll come back here and check on everything. Um, 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 um where was I going again? Ah, Presidium, Citadel Tower. We gotta go talk to Kahuka. I don't. I want to see what happens to that guy who I turned down for the inspection. Maybe he'll sabotage the ship, and then I'll have to murder the man. Um. Um. You're over here. No, well, I don't remember where he is. Where the fuck is he? Um, map? He was here. If he's not, if I can't find him, well, I'm gonna end it here. Um. Let's go back to there. Maybe he's in the Presidium. Maybe he's at a bar? I don't know. I just don't know. Maybe I'll probably talk to him later. He's gotta be around here somewhere. Can't just go away and he's not around anymore, that journal. Um... No, he's not. Hmm. Disappointing. There's one more place I do want to go to, though. So, you know... It's not a lake, it's a massive fucking pond. Difference in the, between those two there, Tali, but apparently you don't get out much. Very suspicious, that guy. I think there's one over here. That big, stupid but jellyfish is back. Let all races herald the glory of the enkindlers who raised them all to enlightenment. Ah. Uh. 
That guy, I don't know, I, I should have got rid of him. Okay, so this is the last place I'm going to go, and then I'll end the uh, recording here. Didn't do a lot of the main missions, but we got a little side missions, and some more insight into uh, some of the side characters and NPCs. And the weird Conrad Vernal. Coming up in a report later today, Emily Wong investigates corruption on the Citadel and uncovers a full-blown crime syndicate. You're welcome. Everything that comes on the news is due to us, because we do everything we are at Tali. We absolutely do. No one... Well, not you, Tali. You haven't done anything, but Liara, me and you, one hell of a team. Deadass. I mean, what? Sorry. Let's just uh, keep moving. Um, um, who's down here? No one. What do you say we head down to Cora's den after shift? Sounds good. Some of the others are going for Novio's farewell thing. Damn, I forgot that was today. Where's he going again? Novaria. Apparently, Ooh. they've got a huge demand for corporate security. Novaria? Isn't that the frozen planet? Yeah, huh, I wouldn't go, but I guess the pay's pretty good. Huh. Hmm. I am not used to this kind of environment. Too much time working by myself, I suppose. Um, I think I'm gonna end it here, actually. And when I come back for the next time, I'll be on the Normandy, ready to do some more side missions. So I got, um, I will catch you guys later. Hope you enjoyed this more episodes of Mass Effect One playthrough, and I'll see you guys next time.